It's the middle of June. What's going on here? This is a row of spruce trees that I've been babysitting for years. Okay, when I first showed up on the scene, um, maybe three years ago, these trees were loaded with flathead borers. Okay, I've been treating the trees and now we only have, there's probably like 20 of them here. Only one still has the flathead borers and I'm not even sure, I think this is a clean tree that I just didn't treat. Um, and you can see these big things of blurg right here. The official term, this is B-L-E-R-G, blurg, and it's pouring out of the trees. And inside of this massive snot, there's a, a worm, and I'm gonna show you that. What do you do? You could spray and spray, but you ain't gonna do anything. This is what you need. Nothing we spray is like this. But this is very controlled, injected. You need a special license to handle this stuff. You actually have to go to Moje School. You need a hazmat endorsement on your driver's license to transport it. This stuff is called Injecticide B. Um, I used to call it Vidrin. It's not Vidrin. Notice I'm wearing gloves. I almost never wear gloves. I hate wearing gloves. You want to drill up to the cambium. You go through the entire outer bark. Pressurize this bad boy. And you put this thing in here like this. Then I'm supposed to have a rubber mallet that I don't have because I forgot. I'm gonna push that in just like that. While I'm pushing it in, I'm closing my eyes for extra protection. This boy, oh boy, every now and then a drop of this splatters. And that's just bad. Pressurize, don't over pressurize. One time once I put my finger through this. That was bad. Again, stick it in there. And tuck your eyes and push. It's not even a good idea to be talking when I do this. I don't like doing this. But I'll tell you right now, we'll get rid of these darn borers. We'll come back here in a year, and this tree will be fine. Now, not only do you want to inject these trees, but the next step is going to be fertilizing the tree because this tree grows from something called the cambium. Cambium is a row of cells that goes around and around the tree and that's where you get your growth rings from. So the object of the fertilization is to get the core cambium spinning faster and faster and the tree can lay down some new growth. Now there are people that will disagree with me and say that, oh, you don't need to fertilize mature trees. Well, I've saved enough of these trees that I've watched other companies basically officiate over the funeral rites. At the end of the day, you got a track record, and I do! And here he is. Look at this bad boy. Look at this ugly duckling here. Here you go. And he's alive and well. And the reason why he's added the, the reason I was able to get him is because this tree is still strong enough that it was able to pitch the tree out. What's happening is all that sap that you see that's called pitch. Okay, and the tree is pitching the grub out. So here's your bora. I'm going to kill it. I hope the pizza people don't get on me. I can't find him. Sometimes the tree pitches out. And, you don't, and it doesn't get the borer out of the tree and I think that's what may have occurred here because I don't see anybody home. I'll dig a little up, there he is. And that was the case. I'll tell you, I went exploring in this tree. This guy might not have been pitched out and here he is. There's another one. I smile just knowing when the sun rises. See.